Happy Wednesday. Hello. I've got somebody in my <coughs> a co-pilot. <laughs> That's it. Navigator extraordinaire. Oh yes, yes. Gigi's just been outside sleeping under a bush. Yes. But he decided to come in when we did. I went round the garden sort of uh, looking for a suitable spot and we didn't know whether he was going to go for his, uh, you know, constitutional or, or what. And then he started scraping it a bit of yeah. soil. And then he didn't like that one, so he went and scraped a bit more. <laughs> and then he sat in it. And he was under the shade of a And then he moved to, yeah. yeah, right under the bush. Yeah, he was quite happy under there. He was. Quite warm out there, though. Yeah, it is. We were going to do on the decking, but Sue was overcome with, with happiness for the sun. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do too much sun. Being a redhead sometimes has its drawbacks. <laughs> I love it when it's lovely, the weather, yeah. but I burn so easily. It's not true. I keep my face out of the sun, that's why I was a little bit pasty, because I can't cope with yeah. it. I have a big massive sun hat that's got a brim on it that would shield a small village, you know? Yeah, right. <laughs> but, uh, I, but I've lost my hat pins again. <laughs> Yeah. Oh no, I just keep out of it because, like I say, I burn that easily. Yeah. You know, 20 minutes in that. <laughs> no, and I look like a beetroot. I tend to, we took, well, we, when Gigi's here, we tend to go out when the the shade of the house comes yeah. across, which is usually around about two to three o'clock. Right. It's still sunny, but we're like sitting in the shady yeah. mood, you know what I mean? So that's when we like it out there. We could sit out there for yeah. ages because we're not in full sun, are we, darling? Yeah. It's going to be lovely in a bit because my son's going to jet wash my decking. And uh, hopefully we're going to paint it with that um, non-slip right. paint. Yeah. Whether it'll be on the same day, I don't know, because it depends whether it's a drying day. That's it. Uh, yeah. And um, got to let it dry out first yeah, for yeah. you. Which is a bit difficult when you're in Manchester. I know, but after saying that, you know, we've had two weeks of this, haven't we? I know. Well, it rained, didn't we, one day, because it came down heavy. In the evening, it came down really heavy. No, we didn't. Oh, we did, here. I was sat there having my tea, and I thought, it's rain. And it was well, I can't hammering remember it. it down, hammering it down. We gave the garden a good watch. Oh, well. Yeah. Well, I haven't got any more crochet to show you than I did yesterday. Because I was quite late making my video, as I told you, I was watching the uh, Manchester, the choirs for the oh, children, right, the yeah. children and the choirs singing. There's something about little kiddies singing, yeah. isn't it? it's nice. And of course everybody else was joining in as yeah. well, but the kiddies were doing most of the singing. And um, I missed all that when I was in the small, because I wasn't yeah. working. So I never went to all these no. performances, not that the song could sing, but... Oh, I was busy decorating yesterday. Mm. She's taken away my boxes anyway. Yeah. My big cardboard boxes. <laughs> Bonus. That, that my bin men don't like yeah. taking. They took the other one because I'd flattened it and it said like roll later on it so they must have thought oh she's an old dear. Well, she's folding it up nice we'll take her that. Yeah. Me? But normally if you put anything else that won't fit in your bin they just no. leave it. They don't like it. And there was no way I was putting boxes in the bin when the bin's just been emptied. No, uh, that's I just it. fit them in at the top if they've got yeah. Bin, yeah. No, I'll take them for you. Ooh, goody goody. See, I've no, got I stopped and watched telly on Saturday. Yeah, for, or for the wedding, for wedding. Yeah. We didn't I go like shopping. anything like that. We didn't go shopping till the afternoon because me, I didn't know my niece would be so interesting, but she was, yeah. Oh no, we got to. Yeah. But like with the kiddies at school, they've been doing Harry and Meghan yeah. and the lead up to the wedding. You know, yeah. the kids were all excited because it was a princess getting married, you know. So as, when I say kids, I don't mean her personal children, I mean her school children. Um, so they've been doing that all yeah. the week before. So I've it's been nice to have a change of a subject, you know. And they've all watched the wedding and it's all over. Yeah. There might have been a small discussion on the Monday, but... Uh, yeah. You know, yeah, about the dress. And yeah, I mean, a lot of people that. wanted her to be more blingy, but I think she got it right. She did, yeah. 
Oh, she's very classy, wasn't she? Yeah, she's not a blinky. Very thing. sort of either sort of Audrey Hepburn or Jackie O, sort yeah. of. Yeah, classy. I don't think she's a little bit person, really. She doesn't look like no. she's a bling. You know, she's never adorned with loads of jewellery, is she? Really? No. I think she's just a classic. Yeah. My Kate dress is quite a classic, doesn't she? Really? Yeah. I knew in the paper on Sunday, I think the outfit that the Duchess of Cambridge wore. Yeah. Um, it was almost like they were having a pop because she'd worn it before. Oh, you know, but with different accessories for different things. Honestly. And I'm thinking, come on, if she'd have had something brand new, they'd have then they'd have said like, you well, know. she spent so much on this. Yeah. No, I think she got it right. I mean, she didn't... And she didn't want to upstage. No, and also, I mean, she's, she's only just had a baby, so I mean, yeah. she wanted something that would skim past her tummy, didn't she? I mean, she's not one of these that snap back into shape, you know? Uh, I think she's done it right. She's obviously yeah. doing it gradually, isn't she, with a, a tummy. Baby's a month old, isn't it, you know? Yeah. So, I mean, I think her tummy's about the right stage for yeah. a normal, um, normal baby mummy tum. I mean, these people who snap back into shape about all the time, they do it. They oh, they will starve themselves and start doing ridiculous things. I mean, I don't know whether she's doing it with Prince Louis, but it's reported that she she breastfed the other two for six months. That's why she why didn't. Not? That's why she didn't do so many yeah. duties. So I mean, she probably didn't want anything too figure for Yeah. You know, because of that reason. So let them be normal. Let them be normal. Yeah, but no, they. Everybody she, looked. Very nice. She's got a month old baby. Yeah. The only one I didn't like was that one who was wearing like well, like an underskirt. That wasn't appropriate. She was showing all her boobs. No, off. yeah. It it definitely wasn't day dress. No, it wasn't and appropriate. Hat. No. It wasn't. I don't know who she was, but um I'm not sure. But it was a bit rude, wasn't it? For it, a it wedding. Was, it was inappropriate. For a wedding, yeah. There yeah. was one gent and all and he sort of like had a you know, shirt tie, waistcoat, jacket, and then beige pants. Why? Yeah. You know, it's the royal occasion. Yeah. Why? Some people don't know how to dress, do they? <laughs> but no, on the whole. Yeah. Everybody looked. Yeah. I believe Oprah, her first choice of clothing, she decided against it because it was either cream or something. And then she said, oh, uh, she hadn't realised like, that you don't wear that colour for a wedding because you don't upstage the bride, yeah? So she changed it for uh, a piggy. Right. Yeah. Well, she looked very nice too. So she did. Nobody knew she was coming. She kept that quite quiet, <laughs> didn't she? Woo! And I'm sorry, but Victoria Beckham, she, she could crack a smile, it would be. She looked like she'd gone to a funeral, didn't she? For yeah. Sake. I think she's very nervous and very shy. But that dress she had on. It was that dark, it, it looked like it was funeral, didn't it? Well, yeah, in the paper, they, you know, I think it was mail on Sunday, oh. they did say she'd dress for a funeral, and I thought, well, hang on a minute, no, it was navy blue, it weren't. I know, but it was still a bit drab, wasn't it? You know, she's with face. Yeah. She's frightened of cracking a smile. I mean, David Beckham was grinning all over the place, wasn't he? Shaking hands with everybody. Yeah. Shook hands with the policeman, didn't he, that was, that was there? Oh, I don't know, I missed that. Bit. Yeah, he shook hands with the policeman that was guarding, like, yeah. everywhere. Yeah, shook hands with him. And he's posing for photographs with all little, you know, the children that yeah. were invited. And, yeah, but she's poor face. <laughs> well, if she did crack a smile when she was talking as well, wasn't she? <laughs> yeah, I did, yeah, I did see a smile. Yeah. His face were a study wound. <laughs> we were doing that bloke was preaching. I mean, it wasn't what he said. It was just that he went on and on and on. I mean, the rows were all having a giggle. Well, mind you, there's nothing wrong with that adult thing because I think he wanted people to smile at the right yeah places and everything. But I think he did take centre stage a bit too long. It was yeah, said it was 15 minutes, didn't they? An hour and a half, it felt like. <laughs> <laughs> well, I must admit, he came on and, and he was doing his mm. 
thing. And I found him quite entertaining. Oh, yeah. And I thought, yeah, yeah. wow, yeah. But then I had to go for a wee, and then I, while I were up, I thought, oh, I'll have a brew, wouldn't Yeah. And he was so I didn't you. miss. I laughed about three quarters way through his speech when he said, well, I'd better sort of start a goal now or something. Let's get these couple married. And I thought, oh, thank God for that. He's got to stop it there. He started off again for another 10 minutes. <laughs> and I was thinking, come on, come on, come on. Let's Man, get the mean, wedding on with. Let's face it. Mm. You know, if it had been, you know, a British member of the clergy, it would yeah. have been a bit dour, wouldn't it? I know, but it would have been Because I must admit, they do tend to be a bit dour. I mean, I know some of the younger generation of vicars and bishops yeah. and what have you can... Mm. Well, be a little bit more... Well, they should have given him a time limit. Well, they probably did, didn't they? I don't know. They, certainly they probably on. knew how long he was going to speak for. Oh. Hellfire and damnation it was, wasn't it? It was a real fire and brimstone. <laughs> I enjoyed it. I did, but well it just went... Him. It just went... And I apologise, because I, I can't remember his name. Oh, I don't know what he was called either. Curry, was he called? So, yeah, Bishop somebody or the Curry, I think it was. Yeah. But he was very good. He was, but he just went on to Yeah. Him. And it was nice that they had some of they had a couple of different faiths there, didn't they? Who said yeah. something. Yeah. I thought that were nice. It oh, was very it was very inclusive and very yeah, you know yeah. And I love that chalice, he was only nineteen, did you do well? Yeah. I mean you thought at nineteen he'd have been scared to death, wouldn't you? Yeah. He did really well. And that gospel choir was brilliant. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely brilliant. Yeah. It was, like I say, oh, it was... It was lovely. It was, I enjoyed it, yeah. Well done, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Yeah. It was nice of um, William, I didn't, William to come up yesterday to the yeah. service in Manchester. He missed his father's birthday, didn't he? Well, I'm sure he'd have been back, back in town. Oh, yeah, but I mean, he missed all the speeches. Yeah. I was watching on a little video about Prince Harry and that bumblebee nearly went in his ear. He was giving that speech at his dad's birthday. Yeah. And then Meghan started to sort of giggle and Prince Charles must have asked her what she giggling at. And his bee came almost in Prince Henry's ear. He's like trying to get rid of it. See, they are human after all. <laughs> Bees are attracted to Prince Harry. Ooh. I thought it was just well, no, me. I was at work on Sunday, I worked Sunday. Yeah. Um, it's a house where there's another house next door. Yeah. Uh, but the girl who came on Monday morning, she'd gone down to Windsor, oh, her yeah. and a friend had gone down yeah. to Windsor. She said, we've got a right good spot. She said, purely by chance. Yeah. On the long walk. Yeah. Do you like that long walk? I loved That's why it's called the long walk. <laughs> I loved it when that horse went a bit crazy. <laughs> I thought it's going to set off. It's going to be galloping up the long walk. Anyway, he managed to control it. Didn't he? he just like backed into the yeah. edge and came back out again. But it, it nearly had a policeman, didn't it? Yeah. Nearly got a copper. <laughs> and the bloody heavy horse, he said. Yeah. Beautifully turned out, though. Yeah. Tell you what, we can't have to do pomp and circumstance. I believe we? that's what Megan had said when she was going through into the private bit, you know. Well, yeah, because she, you know, she you can said, see on her face, it's like, wow. She said something to one of the guards, you certainly know how to do a wedding or something, one of the arts guys. Yeah, but even when she was in the carriage, yeah. it was like, you could see her lips saying, wow, wow oh my God, <laughs> you know, when she saw the amount of people. Yeah. But, you know, uh, yeah, I mean, they can watch videos and, you know, playbacks of other royal occasions, but I think when they're centre stage, yeah, you know, for a, for a newcomer, yeah, I think she was taken aback by it all. Yeah. She was like, what's going on? <laughs> this film set's different than what I'm used to. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, dear. But no, I've been decorating. I have been doing some more of the blankets. Yeah, but we've got a problem, haven't we? Well, I went on lollies and mm. that yarn wasn't on. But mm. don't worry. Don't worry, Simon. Um, I've got it sorted. I know what I can do. And it should look stunning. Yeah. Sometimes when you, you know, you have what you think is a problem. There's always a way around it, isn't there? Yeah. Crochet, and that's the beauty of it. 
yeah, I can sort it out. Yeah. Because okay. even I'm, you know, working away at it thinking, do you know this is lovely? Oh, do you know this is lovely? I finished this top off and that colour there, you know, this, I think it's painless yeah, fab. Painless fab, I think it was. Yeah. I that, finished yeah. up with about a yard. Hey, that's lucky. Mm, I paid yarn chicken. Well, I think one. that looks absolutely yeah. lovely. So summery. And yeah. But I like doing it like with three colours, like I was explaining yeah. yesterday, because you can carry the floats up the side. Yeah. And that means you don't have all these ends to yeah. sew in. Oh, I'm going to have quite a few ends to sew in because with the entry line, yeah. you get to the end of one row and you can't turn it. No, of course. So yes, you start yeah. again at the other side. Yeah. But I thought, do you know what? Just for doing its sake, I'm going to do a small piece. Yeah. And turn it. Yeah. So you've got like. So it, pose, yeah, yeah, it did almost look like knit and pearl, knit yeah. and pearl. Did it look okay? I've not done it yet. <laughs> you see, I'm full of these brilliant ideas. I've got so many ideas. I just keep thinking head, I've got yeah. to do this. I've got to get it. Mm. Oh, well, look it went back out again. It was a bee. All oh, right. It came in and it turned around and went out again. I'm full of ideas, but I... I mean, I mentioned it the other day, and people have been very lovely. They've given me lots and lots of ideas. You know, I say um, what I like isn't necessarily what people want. Yeah. And um, I'd like to have like a fashion student or say or somebody to give me some input yeah. into what's what's sort of in the minute yeah. and what's yeah. And uh, people have been giving me nice ideas on Ooh, what to do for colours and stuff. And, um, I've been that busy, I've not watched any videos, shame on me. I'm so behind with all my videos. Not my own personal ones, obviously. I mean, I do watch well, them. Well, I think that's why I don't watch too many of other people's. Yeah. Because yeah. I keep thinking, no, draw the line, I've got a life, I've got things to do. Yeah. You know, I watch that's why I'm thinking, people. you know, the idea about, oh, doing the Tunisian and turning it and yeah. see how it comes out. See how it does, Look, yeah. get what you've got started, Done. finished. Yeah. Well, I, I'm sorry, mate. I finished. <laughs> That's funny I mentioned that. In, in the video I said, when Sue comes and say we knock her about. <laughs> <laughs> we do. No, I, I, I was finishing this off because I'm a sort of a one work in progress person or a two. Well, you know I'm not. No, well, I'm a bought two. I've got to get, if I've got to get something done, mm. I've got to get it done, haven't I? Yeah, you've got to mm. do the project. Well, I'm doing two of the orders at once. Because um, one I have to think about, one I don't. Uh, one I can just clock on with when I'm yeah. watching the telly. And the other one I have to think more about it because it's that Lena Lovegood, as she called, from Harry Potter. Luna Lovegood. Luna Lovegood, yeah. All right, let's have a And the pattern. Oh, let me look. And the pattern. Because she, she wore some lovely little brushes. Oh, this is that Duh. purpley one. Uh, that's that's not her, that's the lady no. wearing one. But the instructions, yes. the instructions for it are from a 2014 crafty sort of web page, if you know. Right. What I mean. And all the links that she gives are now defunct. Aha. Uh -huh. So you can't, she'll say, she did the sleeves this way using this chart from so and so and, yeah. and it, it's not there. The link's not there. So I had to sort of dream up the sleeves. Yeah. I had to look at loads and loads of photographs of this Luna woman. And Luna Lovegood, yeah. She and was I had a bit to, sort of, uh, you know, the hippy trippy. Yeah. Little blonde. Yeah, I had Very to, sort of mystical, if you yeah, would. I had to. One of my favourite characters, though. Look at a loads of photographs to try and get the sleeves. Right, where's the end? At the end of it, I think my big bum sat on it, I think. All right, all right. I've, oh, I've just seen that. I didn't want to. No, that's the end. Right, put blue down before you get it all oh, over your leg. Is. There it is. Aha, uh -huh. a yarn bullet. All right, yes, one of them. Yeah. So that's where I'm up to at the moment. I've done the sleeves. I've got to go down with the body now. All oh, right, I, yeah. Yeah. See where I'm going? Yes, I do. So I'm going to have to alter it because I was explaining yesterday that where she told me to put this buttonhole here, it's there. Right. And it's not right. Can you see what I mean? It should be there. 
Right. But I've got to go around it with a double crochet. Yeah. So I'm going to ignore that big one. Yeah. And go make Fudge one of these others. Fudge it. Yes. Fudge it. Make one of those, yeah. But the sleeves, it didn't tell you how to do them. So right. I had to just... What yarn are you using? Uh, it's lovely. It's... Um, it does. It feels absolutely gorgeous. Oh, what does it call it? It's, it's full cotton. Yeah. Pink or... Oh, right. Yeah. Have I not sat on it? Uh, yeah. Here we go. Cotton soft, king cotton. Right. Oh, very. Yeah. Oh, it, it, nice. Yeah. That. It's not What's the that? cheapest one in the world, but uh, it was the colour. Oh, nice. Yeah. She wanted the colour. You see, that yeah. um, was more like Luna, Lena, Luna. <laughs> Keep Luna. calling her Lena. It's Luna. I had an auntie Lena. I had an auntie. She Lena. was a great auntie, actually. But we always just called her auntie Lena. No, I had an auntie Lena. She used to do all the errands. You know, right. from Scotland. Yeah. Because I always wonder, I kept thinking, what's it short for, Lena? Was she Eleanor or something no, like that? Lena. But no, it's just Lena. Yeah. So I've got to carry on doing it. It's only a short body because it's like a, a bolero. Yeah. You know what I mean? But the sleeves are quite wide and yeah. fluty. Oh, uh, lovely. Yeah, I'm so happy with well, that. That yarn's gorgeous. It is lovely, isn't it? As well, I said, it's not the cheapest. Not buying any more. Not buying old. We're waiting to go to Lolly's. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, we're waiting to go to Lou for our little fest. <coughs> yeah. But I'm sorry, but sorry, Wool Fest, but we won't be taking our wallets and spending. No. <laughs> there will be plenty of people there who'll be buying your stuff, won't they? But yeah. Not us. Not us. With the poor section. <laughs> well, no, but with the, I, I would contradict that and say no. We're not the poor section, but the practical section. Yeah. You know, because how many us. people stand there and hand wash, you know, woolen items and what have you. I mean, I know I've done it in the past, but oh, if yeah. you've got a favourite piece, it gets I a used bit to... wearing. I'd sooner have something that some people can... Oh, I can remember the baby things. Yeah. Hand washing all the baby things. Oh. Well, that's it these days with, you know, mums yeah. working as they do. Yeah, you know, all it's little sort of like if it's not machine washable, because yeah. you can guarantee, yeah, you put a lovely cardigan on, yeah, and they go, oh, that, yeah, and then they go, bleh, down bleh. it. I always remember getting our ear ready for a special occasion, and I had a beautiful white broad rayon because they had a big pram, huge pram, big broad rayon lay, and I put it all on, and we were ready to go, and he went, yeah, all over it. So I had to go with this second best blue nylon one. It wasn't the same. And it's just same. not the same. No, it wasn't. No, I wanted no. this white broad rayonglet one. Well, that's kids for you, especially babies. Mm. They just, all the days are crispy collars. Yeah. You know, when you give it it that. All, the, all the days when the people said to you, oh, have you got, where's the baby? Because you've got a big tree on, yeah. on your back. Because you've gone like that, haven't you? <laughs> We didn't have these burp cloths in that them days. We used to throw a nappy over them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not a paper nappy like you have these no, days. No, Terry, Terry, the Terry nappy. nappy used to go over the shoulder. Yeah. Didn't it? And the number of times you've gone out with nappy pins pinned. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> People are saying, that's a lovely brooch. And you go, going, what? And you've got uh, a nappy pin there. A nappy pin there. Look at me now. Covered I'm, in Gigi. I'm Miss Hair. Miss Hairy. Yes, little Miss Harry, I am. Because somebody wants this, you know. Oh, you spoil him. I know. I don't have him every day. No, so. I make the most of him. I like to cuddle. Look yeah. at you. What are you doing, G? He says, I'm happy. Just leave me. He said, ignoring. I'm ignoring you. I'm, I'm just ignoring you because I'm very, very happy where I am. Thank you very much. <laughs> Yes, wait when your friend Poppy comes in a couple of weeks. Eh? You like play with Poppy, don't you? Oh, she's lovely, Poppy. <laughs> Absolutely lovely. She's got such beautiful eyes. She's just got a face that sort of says, Love me. Hiya, love me. Love me. Love me. And then she scratches your leg, don't she? Ch -ch -ch. And that's the signal. I want petting. Yeah. So you pet her for, here. You pet her me, for 10 lovely. minutes and then she goes. It's like, are we going to see how long it is before she gets bored of being petted? Oh, no. And it, I get fed up long before yeah. she does, let's just say. 
Same with this little fella. Look at him. He's grumbling now because I've got a necklace on. And it's... Oh, is it not comfy, Bonnie? No, he doesn't like it when I've got a necklace on. I have to take it off. What are you like? If you're wondering what all that noise is, it's the tarpaulin uh, rustling outside. Yeah. Because I would the... the chairs. Yeah. We should do the very comfy, she says, but I've had to put some other cushions on that one because I can't get out of the other. So me thinking, oh, I've got an excuse not to face the sun here. Yeah. I'll go and sit in it. Oh, we need this comfy. And oh, she's right, you can't get out of it. <laughs> He's got a bottom shape cushion, you know, on the seat. And yeah. it's sort of like, sat down. oh, am I going to go through it? And then you think, no, you're not. But yeah. oh, it's all comfy. Yeah, it is comfy. So comfy. But I have to sit higher up. I've got two big cushions yeah. underneath the cushion. It would be a proper I mean. good comfy cushion, uh, grocery chair. Yeah. It is. Yeah. It is, isn't it, Gigi? Especially when Gigi wants to sit on your knee. <laughs> and you can't leave your grocery. We have to wait, though, until the sun goes off the deck in a bit. Because yeah. it gets too hot. Well, I get too hot as well. Unless I'm wearing my keep the sun off a big village, you know. Yeah. My big hat. Yeah. I don't know why I've got them all upstairs. I had them all downstairs and then I thought, and it was winter. Yeah. Take them all upstairs. The sun out comes out, bed. right, well, leave them upstairs because we quite like the sun. <laughs> so all my sun Better hats. Better than the usual rain. All my sun hats are upstairs now. This, we've got to make the most of it because this is summer. Yeah. Might only last I know we've week. got to uh, they've forecast it till the end of the week, but yeah, enjoy it. It's well, my summer. son's coming to to jet wash the deck in sometime, um, so you can get your boots. It'll be raining when he comes. Right. All this nice weather, he'll be, yeah. he's working, so he's got to fit it in on a day well, when he's not I went working. Outside, I've got decking as well, yeah. and I thought, yeah, I should get pressure washer out. Yeah. While well, I can. And then the thought went off me. I thought, no, I've got better things to do. <laughs> no, Arian knows I can't. I can't yeah. do it. So. Takes but me all the time to push the hoover. I definitely couldn't do a press, pressure washer. Yeah, but no, busy at the moment doing doing the bathroom and yeah. like I've got a separate toilet and I've got all that done yesterday. Yeah. Bath flooring. But I went to a carpet shop I know that does like yeah. offcuts. Um, but we were out in a fan said, mm. and he said, oh, you're right, well, you know, they do, and I said, what are we after? He says, oh, obviously I've got some offcuts coming in tomorrow, so. So you've got to go back? I've got to go back. Man, it probably won't be tomorrow, it'll be day after, what day after? Friday. Yeah, it's but, Wednesday today. Yeah, yeah. but. Um, and then he'll say, should have come in yesterday, they've all gone. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think it's going to be like that. Um, <laughs> But I've got the main bathroom to do. Hang yeah. some wallpaper. I've pa painted. Yeah. Done all the emulsion in. But I've got the paper to hang. Yeah. I've got um, you know, like a light bloom ottoman. Yeah. I've had it. God, twenty five years. Yeah, you can't get them like when that now, though. Me and my fella first moved in together. Our first yeah. house. I think I was walking to work one day, or walking for bus to go to work, and there were a skip in back street, and it were in skip, and I thought, ooh, 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 not throwing that away, are they? <laughs> and I went round and I said, are you throwing everything, you know, yellow, if you want it, take it, and trotted off back home with it. Yeah. And I painted it a different colour. But I tell you what, in the intervening time, I have forgotten how hard it is painting Lloyd Lou. Oh gosh, you have to get your little brush in between. Oh, them. I know, I know. Don't say spray paint because I bloody hate spray paint. Oh no, don't, don't like it. It would give it a good finish, but well, I try. I started painting it. It goes everywhere when you spray paint it. Even if you go outside, you get your deckings covered in it and, oh. No, I don't like spray paint. So I've got, shall we say, an undercoat on it. And I'm thinking, why the hell did you start this? Because you thought it was a good idea. Yeah, it's fine. 
Anyway, the colour I've decided I decided to use isn't quite right. Mm. So not to worry, I have a pot of something else that'll do. I got rid of all my paint. Old posh. I got rid of all my paint because it was just lingering too long. It's been there since since I used to paint, <laughs> which was a long time ago. Yeah. I mean, my, that I want to get the bedroom done eventually because yeah, nobody goes in my bedroom. It's just not not a sanctuary. It's just just where you sleep. <sighs> it's got no wallpaper on it, and it's just no. <laughs> I don't let anybody in there. Once it's decorated, I'll have an opening ceremony. <laughs> right <-o. laughs> Well, I'll tell you what, I've got a paste table. Yeah. And I haven't lost the art of pasting. I, I was quite... Um, I what I've done, mm. I'm dead chuffed with. Yeah. You know, matched all the pattern. And yeah, I can't walk It paper. was... When I was married, um, my ex used to say that, like, I was glad about it. Wallpaper was his job. Yeah. And as I had about the other 99,000 jobs to do, I'll let him do his yeah. decorating. But that means now that I can't do it because he never let me yeah. even try. Oh, no, I've always... No. My ex-father-in-law was a patron decorator. Oh, yeah. And he showed me how to paste properly. Mm. And well, mm. I'd be the one pasting everything. And, yeah. You know, I did. they'd be the ones hanging it sort I've of thing. I've never tried. I should try, but it cost me back now. Drive me mad. But um, my bedroom, oh, what's that noise? What's oh, the next door banging? Um, my bedroom, it's got a horrible galaxy. Well, gold. And then I stuck them. That's little, the only thing. I stuck them little leaves all over it. And I don't think you can paint over and I don't think you can get them off. You know, they were like filigree leaves right. in gold. And I thought it was going to be great. And I stuck them all around them like this. You know, the ceiling goes yeah. down. It's got like a picture in yeah. So I thought it was a great idea to stick these little gold leaves like all the way around. Of course, now I don't want it anymore. I have two ceilings that I yeah. want to paper. Mm. Oh, I can't paper. Well, I've never papered a ceiling. No, it's hard. And what have you. And I keep thinking, I need to find a decorator. Mm. But nobody seems to know. You know, because I'd yeah. sooner go off personal recommendation, to be honest. Yeah. But me and my granddaughter, we've decided we're going to give it a go. The last time I papered a ceiling, I well, was... Well, you know, I need her, somebody. Yeah, And I said to her, I said, I just yeah. need so, you yeah, to... Steady and everything, don't you? Yeah. Hold the bit, or the other bit. Yeah, why are you doing with that? The, with, yeah. a, with a brush. Yeah, why are you doing that bit? Well, I try and... Well, the last, it'll be a laugh. The last time I helped to paper a ceiling, I was eight and a half months pregnant. And we had two step ladders and a plank in between. So my ex was almost six foot, which is like a foot, yeah. foot taller than me, near enough. And um, I'm holding my arms up, you know, eight and a half months pregnant, holding my arms up, holding his paper up. And he's going back a bit, back a bit. I only walked off the end of the plank, didn't I? Yeah, and I said, that's it. <laughs> Not doing it anymore now. <laughs> I was scared to death. I thought I'm going to have the baby now and it's early. You know, it's like yeah. two or three weeks early. And I thought, oh, I don't want the baby now. So I said, I'm not doing it anymore. Oh, I remember papering um, at an old house that we had. I know I'm doing a right good job. And we had alcoves outside at fireplace, you know. Yeah. Paper these alcoves. And there was like, you know, they used to build in at like a V-telly and everything. Yeah. So yeah. I was standing on that doing thing. Yeah. Yeah. Only stepped back, stepped off. Knew I was stepping off, but I put a foot in the pace bucket. <laughs> <laughs> Trouble was, why? Don't ask me. I have no idea. But I had a pair of shoes on that were like my favourite shoes. Yeah. And all I could think of was my bloody shoes. So yeah. I went and rinsed up, but that shoe was always slightly darker <laughs> than the other shoe afterwards. I, it was I mean, I could no, I could, I could yeah. tell. I mean, I don't think it was that obvious to anybody else, but it. I thought you were. I was mortified. I was so upset that dead sticky. No, I was so upset that I'd, I'd, yeah. I'd done it, but no, it washed off. Yeah, washed out. I was the your paint roller tray. All oh, right. I'll study one of them, yeah. No, I've never done that, but no. 
step step back to have by be handy work and I always remember my dad telling me the tale when he was just newly married he decided he'd decorate uh, the bedroom and he decorated it all he was beautiful he decorated he thought I've done a good job matched it all up and his mate came in and he said do you like me oh, job he said it's very nice John he said but cherries aren't supposed to grow upwards <laughs> oh gosh <laughs> He said, cherries? He said, I thought they were flowers. <laughs> so he decorated it all with his cherries. Instead of hanging down like yeah. a bunch of cherries, he got them going upwards. Going upwards, yeah. But he said, stay yeah, like that. Stay like that, it's not changing. Yeah. But, uh, no, my ex wasn't a bad decorator. He used to yeah. decorate. And then I had a friend who used to like decorating for me. In fact, that's when she last did the bedroom. But um, my daughter-in-law stripped it all off for me. She's borrowed a stripper. Yeah. Me. Well, she stripped it all off for me, and then uh, of course they had their own house to do then. And somehow or another, it's never been done after that. Oh, and then she hurt her knee. Yeah. She had an operation. On her <coughs> Trouble is, you go and look at wallpapers, and there's some absolutely gorgeous ones these mm, days. Mm. Absolutely beautiful. Mm. I know. I I've, I've already bought months ago I thought that's what I'm having with bathroom um, and it's got flowers and birds on it yeah totally not me but I just thought oh yeah. I like that but since there's some absolutely fantastic ones and I, I think birds and flowers are in this yeah this season because I've seen some absolutely gorgeous ones yeah but uh, no I'll stick with what I've got I like it I tend to well, go with you know, just plain now. Yeah. Because of the fact I can't wallpaper and stuff like that. So I can just. Yeah, but the thing is, you can just give it a coat, coat of paint, paint on it. Yeah. yeah. I struggle a bit at the top, yeah. you know, but well, I can I've got do some gorgeous. Um, some, I can do lower down, yeah. Um, and it's like maps. Yeah. And I think it's absolutely stunning. Yeah. And I just bought a couple of rolls of it, thinking I'll. I'll use that, yeah. and um, I've actually done it on a bedding box because I've mixed the paste up. I thought, oh, clever, isn't she? And it look, it does look stunning. Yeah. Even grandkids that came yeah. yesterday and said, "Oh, grandma, look at that!" If I could crochet wallpaper, I'd be all right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Tell you what, I'm thinking of doing. You know them lovely things that Grace got me. They're lovely. Yes. Curves. I was thinking of putting one, you know, on the wall here. Yeah. There's a wall hanging. I don't know how you do it, but... Yeah, I know what you mean. Apart from but if, we video, if you're videoing here, yeah. you probably want the plain background to yeah, show. Yeah, probably would do, yeah. But I'd, I'd do it on that wall. Yeah, but I've got that stupid door in the middle. Yeah, well, it'd cover it, wouldn't it? Yeah. You know, when it was all the fashion to have a hatch? Yeah. This was my dining room. And, and so then when the hatch I had, through from the kitchen. And then the hatch through from the kitchen, which was handy at the time. Because you put all your dishes yeah. to but now it just got my microwave in at the other side of it. <laughs> and it's a sh everybody goes, why have you got a door? I keep thinking I'll paint it cream and then yeah. it merge in a bit better with the wall. Next time I paint the wall, I'll paint the same colour on the door. Yeah. Then it would look a bit more. Yeah. Well, well we've done a lot of chatting about decorating and not much chatting about I know. Project. No, I shall... Uh, we we'll go off on a tangent, you have to excuse me. Yeah. No, we shall do some more crochet talk next time. Yes. Because I'm aiming to get some... And I will take the camera done. with me if we do ever get to Lolly's. But this lady's working too much. She's working too hard. Tell her. Tell yeah. her. She's working too hard. It's not so much I'm working too much and too hard. Yeah. It's just like I don't get as much notice. Yeah. I don't have a rotor to work yeah. to like I, I used to. That's what I said yesterday, You know, it? so... I've just got to... Yeah. I said, I'm being selfish here because I know she needs to work. I said, but I miss the coming. <laughs> I liked it better when you weren't working. Yeah, it came every week. Is, yeah, no, but the thing is, <laughs> I think I prefer it if I got to work a few more weekends. Unless during the week. Unless during the week. I've always... Yeah. Like that. Because mm. at the weekend, you just get... You know, everybody who works during the week out... I think he's got his eyes open, but he's snoring. 
Mind you, no, he, he had his eyes shut before. He, yeah. he says, no, he's talking about me. Oh, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm going to try and get a bit more done. Mm. Well, I've got to get these orders out of Yeah. But my lady who wanted the magenta sweater, she's going after me. <laughs> get in touch with me, otherwise she's going to lose the place completely, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I've sent her a picture of the three colours I've got. And I asked her to choose and I've not heard from her since, so... She's going further down the Make queue. Make a choice. She's going further down the queue, my lady is. She doesn't let me know soon what colour she wants. I'll be starting on something else. That's it. Yes. With my bright colours and things like that. I think it might be a shower next time. Yeah. Oh, I'm really taken with this Tunisian entry work. Yeah. I've got a Tunisian book, she'll have to have to have a look, yeah. I think there isn't an, an ultra like something or other. Might be a waistcoat. Do book. you know I've seen something? Yeah. Yes, I think. I think it might be a waistcoat in one yeah. of my books. Because if you remember, I've got quite a few books. <coughs> I think they might be upstairs because I think I put them up there. Knowing that they're not on my yeah. to-do list immediately. Yeah. Mm. That's what we'll do. We'll have another look. Yeah. Because I keep... Th there's a... Um, a stitch pattern and I keep seeing it on Pinterest but it's bound to be in them books I, I know but I keep following the links you know when it yeah. says and, and I not. can't get anywhere with them you know sometimes yeah. you just follow the links and there's nothing yeah but I've, there's this sti stitch that yeah. I'm thinking oh, I'd, let's do that it's like that little love good thing I'm doing all the links are dead you know that it yeah. tells you to go to so it's kind of like a bit of guesswork really yeah <laughs> plus i must admit i'm not too up on you know tunisia like yeah. stitch terms and no. what have you because it says that. like Tun tunisian pearl stitch i wouldn't know it if it hit me in well, first i find that video i guess that yeah took, not video yeah I'm, dvd I'm, I'm back in the times no, it's a DVD, whatever it is. It's inside the book. Is it Kim de Guzman who does? I don't know. The Tunisian? I don't know. Or is it? I don't know. They're upstairs somewhere yeah. anyway. There's a book in there with a DVD yeah. in it. And then there's two or three other books I bought. I know, because we have sat before and we put the DVD on and we're, we're, we're both sat there with sat a bottle with a of this bloody Tunisian <laughs> hook and we're going, oh yeah, oh, oh yeah, oh. <laughs> Oh, we got it, and then we went. Didn't and then, use yeah, it, and then it, it went. went. Yeah. Tell your goldfish brain. Give me money out the other. I just want, said I really determined. wanted to do the intro like bit. That's my um, thing I had on my sort of uh, what do you call it resolutions for the new year was to teach myself uh, more stitches. In, yeah. In, and to get more into this tuning. Yeah. I just wanted to do the intro. That yeah, was it. Yeah. I just want to get my tension right. Oh, my tension's bloody. Yeah. I'll. If I'll I. To cock, it's just. If I do anything, it's going to have to be like this. Yeah. Which is off my head, because I just cannot get to follow a pattern. I can't get the stitches tension right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm all plus with tension. Always have been. Always will be. You know. Yeah. I can go up and down hook sizes, up and down yarn sizes. Yeah. And. You know, I can get do, a reasonable thingy, but... Yeah, I can do four-ply patterns in double knit. Yeah. I can do double knit patterns in fingering. Well, that's and, it, yeah. but... But Tunisian... Uh, Around your blankets, it doesn't matter that much, does it? Yeah, well, I don't do blankets. You don't I like... Oh, well, I like my blankets. You like blankets, yeah. because Tina likes blankets. I don't like blankets. Well, that's fine. It's because good, because we wouldn't... You can leave them to me. It wouldn't do for us all to be alive. No. 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 So we'll have to concentrate on what we like doing and I think I've done from, I've done four tops until recently yeah oh the four tops is it, is it yeah yeah four tops singing group um so I think it's time I did a shawl next when I've done my orders um I've not done a shawl for ages no because I've got all that magic oh they've got magic on offer haven't they oh they haven't have that yeah I deleted it quick ah! <laughs> I am not looking Get thee behind me, Satan. Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> and even Lolly. Lolly's got some new colours and all. And I went, no, I'm not looking. I deleted hers as well. Not oh, looking, Lolly. Dear. I'm not looking, honestly. 
little. No, we'll have to sort one a day out for go go to Lolly's. Yeah, we will. We will. And if it's you, well, we'll take you with us. Yes, we will. Because you'll sit in the front seat yeah. with me like this. We might shed a few hairs, but apart from that. <laughs> we're not sit on back seat? No. No? No. We won't sit anywhere we're on. Right. No. You'd have to be inside. Well, what do they do when? Sitting on me. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. Put you in the seat belt, don't we? We sit you on our knee. No, he won't sit on back seat. No, because there's own, some new you? rules out there, supposedly, about pets well, being, being secured. Maybe on me. But you know, when you see these, you know, builders' dogs hanging out the van window, <laughs> Are you seeing them? and others with ears flapping out. Have you seen those car seat things for dogs, and they're like sitting up like that? Oh, oh no! I thought Gigi wouldn't do that. No. No. You sit quiet. I know my friend. She has two Russells, and she has they have like a harness, but the, it clips onto yeah the seat you know into the seat belt yeah. thing just to restrain them so they yeah. don't no our Ian's dogs used to travel in the boot you know they'd... yeah they have um yeah one of them dog grip thingies dog grills yeah yeah and they go in they have um this grill up so they can't fall forward yeah and um but there was i mean there were, when they were trying to sell these dog seats dog seats they were showing like a mock-up obviously with a toy dog you know, when they were pulling up and this dog came flying out the back seat and like landed back on the windscreen, you know, and flying through. But don't worry, dear, we'd hold on to you. Yeah. It probably won't be a day when he comes no. because he doesn't come that often now. But just in case, because I can't leave him all day. Can we not? No. Can't leave you. I've got a carrier for him anyway. That fits yeah. on me. That he sits inside, yeah. Yeah. He likes that because he goes to sleep in it. It's a padded carrier. Actually, I got a dog carrier and it, it wasn't, didn't work. No. So I got a baby carrier. And know, he loves it. And he loves a baby carrier. Oh, you great fat softy. Yeah. Who's a great fat softy? Because one day when it was raining, it was so funny, you went right underneath. Like, I'm not getting wet. All you could see was a little bit of a hump yeah. on his back. He went right inside the carrier. You know, it started off like looking out. Kind of laughing, do blame him. Yeah, we started off looking out round <laughs> like that. As soon as it started raining, it was like, poof, nose dived in this little carrier. No, I'll see, if, I'll see about doing some at next week. Yeah, the only day I'm not around next week is 31st, is it Thursday? What is that? I've got to get my feet done. Thirty first is Monday, isn't it? Right. Thirty, yeah, because I've got Sunday Monday sleep, which is the thirtieth and thirty first. Yeah. Well, thirty first is the other day. I'm not here next week. I've got to go. I've got to sleep midweek next week. Yeah, I've got my toes trimmed. Right. Well, it'll be a week after. Yeah. And I'll say. Yeah. Because I'm not going anywhere then until the middle of June. And I've got Poppy on top, but she's mm. alright to be left. It's just him. Yeah. Poppy is quite happy to just to sleep. You know, if I've got her yeah. that week, yeah. She's, she'll do five, six hours on her own, Poppy. She's quite a happy little girl, so. Yeah. Man, she's used to it with. Yeah, well, you know, she's, when she's sort of unused to it at the moment because. She's only yeah, but but she, she was has used, been used. She, oh, to she it, actually she, used yeah. to be a left. Yeah, she's. See, so we'll have an adventure to tell you all about. Woo! Lolly's little moonshot. But it won't be for a couple of weeks. But no, we will sort it. No. We'll sort. We'll it. sort it. We will. We will. Yeah, we'll have to get when Kelly goes with Christina. We'll have to get her to take a camera. Yeah, tell her to do one as well. She's more shy than I am though about just yeah. filming in PU places. <laughs> Me, I'm not a bother, I just say, do you mind if I film, you know? <laughs> Mostly they don't because it's like advertising yeah. for them, isn't it, yeah. Um, there's only one woman that was doing little felted things that didn't want me to um, film when I went to that craft. Yeah. 